Well, if you're looking for a place to escape this brutal heat wave, you're in luck. Yeah, so we have built in air conditioning right here in Colorado. You just have to go to the higher ground. Your Port of the Mountain, Spencer Wilson, takes us to the top of the peaks where people are still able to tube on snow. While we're talking about one of the biggest heat waves Colorado has seen in years, you can still find snow if you know where to look for it. Keystone Snow Tubing Hill at the top of the gondola is one of the coolest places in Colorado right now. We are right now over 11,600 feet high in elevation at the country's only summertime snow tubing hill. That elevation brings a bit of relief for Coloradans and tourists alike, like Pete and Christine, here from one of the hottest places in the U.S., Florida. Yeah, today is probably like 96 with a heat index of 106. Hence why we're here. Thankfully, they picked the right time to be on the mountain. You know, just to be able to come over here and just enjoy 70 degrees. And even down at the base, I heard people saying it was too hot. 75 for us is heaven. Sending lane one, no send two. The snow is left over from the massive snow fort Keystone builds every winter, pushed over the hill and piled into the strip of cold white fun. It's fast, it's fun. It's a, it's a nice way to escape the heat. Uh, you're really not thinking about how warm it is, how hot it is once you're shooting down a mountain on snow. Just a short magic carpet ride later, and you're back up at the top and ready for more. So keep this in mind as an option this weekend. While it might be cooler up here, you're certainly still getting an awful lot of sun. And as you know, all Coloradans do, the higher in elevation you go, the more sun you'll get. So make sure you're bringing your sunscreen if you're coming up here. At the top of Keystone, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado first.